Hello everyone, we are from Mary Marigold team. This week, we need to take on the Tropical Biome Challenge. In this week's diary, we will recap our team's experience on this Tropical Biome Challenge. From our experience, the first thing we need to do is to talk to the NPCs either the farmers or the lab scientists. The NPCs will give us useful information that related to the tropical biome and we can use the info given and consider the resources available, whether to purchase the suggested tools or genetically engineered seeds. As only one person is communicating with the NPCs at one time, we need to pass the message to other team members and what's happening and experiencing, as we are sharing same budget and working as one team. Then, the first thing to do is to till the soil, and we can do it faster if every member start the tilling together. Afterward, we need to consider buying either genetically engineered seeds that have special traits or normal seeds for planting. The outcome for this biome challenge will be the total score showed in the final stage which is harvesting stage. The total points will be calculated based on scores collected on soil quality, weed penalty, water level, till delay, balanced coin and also the harvest count. There are some elements of farming been modified in this Minecraft map where we need to address weeds and insect pets, soil quality and fertilizer, water level and dryness of the soil, and also genetically engineered seeds that have certain traits either they are herbicide tolerance, dot tolerance and etc. All these new elements added mimics the real life farming, where as farmers we need to take proactive role in managing the farm. If the farm is left unmonitored, the weeds will grow and take over the plot, the insect pets will eat the crops, the soil quality will drop and the water level may not enough to keep the soil moisture and healthier. All these will eventually destroy the crops and we may not have good harvest for an unattended farm. In short, this modified Minecraft map applies and adapts agricultural production techniques in tropical biomes. Next time we will collaborate with each other on how to divide and conquer the plots, and who's in charge of taking care of insect pets, while another team member in charge of destroying the weeds. This is to avoid both team members go for the same thing at the same time, but accidentally working backwards. We will also constantly monitor the soil quality score, make sure it is always healthy. Besides, we will also maintain enough water level, to avoid water penalty while fighting off the caterpillar, and destroying the weeds. Talking about destroying the weeds, we may need to practice more on the punching the weeds, and not accidentally damage the crops and we need to act quickly to avoid the weed taking hold the plots, and destroy our crops. Same goes to fighting the insect pets, we will choose butterfly net to avoid destroying the crops while fighting off the insect pets. Lastly, we will practice more to do better and better and improve our farming process to gain higher score in future.